Modeling is a process that uses math to represent, analyze, make predictions, or otherwise provide insight into real-world phenomena. It begins with defining the problem statement. You'll probably find that your problem is still too complicated. Sharpen your focus by making assumptions. These basic conjectures allow you to reduce the number of factors affecting your model, helping you decide what's important. We make assumptions to simplify our question because in real life there are so many variables that we cannot consider. So by making assumptions, we're basically simplifying and making our jobs easier. If your city council asked you to figure out the best recycling methods, assumptions are important. While brainstorming, start with defining terms. You'll need to define the word best in a way that is quantifiable. Let's say the assumption you make is that best means at the least cost to the city. With money on your mind, it's easier to decide what recycling methods should be considered. Out of the many possibilities, you may assume the city would find a limited number of methods practical and cost-effective. If you assume best means processes the most recyclables or means highest participation rates, you may consider different factors that lead to different models. If you assume something and it's a big enough assumption that it affects all of your data and you come to a stopping point where things just don't make sense, you're going to have to go back and reevaluate. Assumptions will help you make sense of your research and let you focus on your problem. Here are some important tips to consider while making assumptions. Assumptions often come naturally from the brainstorming process. Preliminary research will help you make assumptions. In the absence of relevant data, it is reasonable to make and justify your assumption. Assumptions often develop as you move through the modeling process. It's best to keep a running list as you proceed. Remember, making assumptions will help reduce the amount of information you have to consider, helping you focus on the right information you need to solve your problem. For more information on the math modeling process, visit m3challenge.siam.org.